Hello, assalamu alaikum. I hope you're doing great. Today I am going to share my Mediterranean Rambo trout recipe with you. I have all of my ingredients in front of me. So let's follow the recipe. All right, so these are the ingredients that I am going to um, use to make this dish. Um, first of all, I've got uh, trout filet here. I am going to cut this into uh, at least three different pieces so it's easier for me to pan sear that. Um, let's put this on the side. Let me show you the ingredients that I'll be using. I've got uh, black pepper powder, granulated onion, granulated garlic, some salt, homemade curry powder, and the, some cayenne pepper. So first things first, I am going to cut this filet into smaller pieces so it's easier for me to cook and to put spices on. So this size is perfect. Okay, there you go. This is good. So I was able to make three fillets. Next, what I am going to do is add some olive oil. Rub some olive oil on top of these fillets to, so the spice can, all the spices that I'm going to add can easily stick. Okay, next I am going to add these spices in a, a flat plate mix them around and mix them enough that all the you know flavors are nicely mixed before adding and before dipping the trout fillets so there you go okay. i'm going to do is dip this trout Okay, so let's take the next one, dip that, there you go, all right, so let's dip, dip this one, you have to make sure the, you know, the filet is nicely covered with spices, there you go, you can see that, and I have some more on the side, there you have it, so all of my uh, Flays are nicely covered with spices. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to take you over to the stove and I'm going to shallow fry these flays in um, olive oil. So let's go over there and cook that. So I've added the olive oil in this pan. Um, I didn't add too much. It's just enough that I'm going to be able to um, shallow fry or pan sear the flays. Uh, my stove is on. I'm just waiting for olive oil to heat up. And then I am going to add... Uh, I think I can fit maybe two flays in this pan. I'll cook on each side um, until it's fully done. And then I'll show you the, uh, how the fish looks. And of course you can serve this fish either with salad, um, with rice. You can just have it um, with any other soupy dish and rice. And then you can serve this on the side as well. So it's totally up to you, but this is a really, really tasty um, fish. And it actually turns out pretty, um, awesome so i hope that you do enjoy it okay so the oil is ready let's add the fillets there you go i think i can add another one here oh actually one more so my heat is on low there you go and i am going to fully cook this before flipping it over and i'll show you okay so time to flip these fillets gonna take another maybe a minute or so it doesn't take that long to cook this fish and the fillets are quite thin so i'm just gonna wait another minute or so and then i'll show you how the crust looks on the other side it has a really nice um crispy crust um, that it creates because of the spices uh, some people also add a little bit of flour um, but i'm i know minimum carb is good so i didn't add that but that's optional you could add a little bit of flour in the spice mix and then make a dry rub and add that on top. It will create even more crispier texture, but this is enough for me. So, and it tastes really good. So let's uh, wait another minute or so and I'll show you how it looks. All right, looks like the fish is done. Let's turn this around. Look at that. It is a bit spicy because I added um, 
cayenne pepper, so you obviously have to adjust according to your taste. Now this is how it looks. It's really, really nice, and you can tell the crust is really crispy on top. See that? Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, please do remember to subscribe to my channel. Till next time, take care and stay safe.